Whoa, whoa, whoa. What's up, internet? How's it going? Uh, we're back with Slay the Spire, and we're doing the mod for Dazzle. It is a, actually a Dota 2 mod, apparently. I've never played Dota 2, so I don't know. Um, but we are we play a Shadow Priest that heals and manipulate the buffs to defeat enemies. Healing is also applied as damage to all enemies. Oh, that sounds sick. So I'm going to preface this by saying I'm not a pro. Uh, I do this for fun, and... You know, obviously I don't expect to beat it, but hey, I have a good time. Let's do the next three, uh, three enemies. Ah, uh, damn it. It's all the way up here, and there's no path to get there where it'll have one HP. Uh, I see a pretty good path right here. A lot of options. Three stores along the way. This is pretty good. All right, so let's look at our cards. We have the typical strikes, defends. We have a healing salve, gain three regeneration. Gain energy while in your hand, heal one at the end of your turn. So we can't play that, that just stays there. Lose two HP, draw two. Increase the HP cost of this card by two this combat. Why would I do that? Deal 14 damage if the target intends to attack at a wound into your hand. All enemies lose 3 strength this turn. Game block 3 times. I think that'll be a good, um... That'll be a really good defense to use. Let's see what our next one is. Oh, what's that? Add 3 bounty runes to your hand. I don't know what that means. Split up and farm. Gain 6 block, gain 6 gold. Wraith Band, gain 2 block to 5 damage. Effect is doubled if the floor number is 25 or higher. Hmm. Exhaust a card. Gain regeneration equal to twice its cost. Ironwood branches and trees always grant 6 regeneration. Um... Is, uh, I'm assuming regeneration is uh, you gain that HP at the end of turn. Don't know. We're going to make some assumptions here. Gain 10 block, heal 10 HP. You cannot gain HP from healing for the rest of this combat. Uh, no. Deal two additional damage for every 10 HP the target is missing. So that does significantly more damage over time. Remove all of your debuff, gain three artifacts, gain four block for every unused. Eh. I tend to use all my mana. Was it there? Energy, whatever. <laughs> you can tell I, I play a lot of magic. Um, let's do deal eight damage to all enemies. And then. Brigand's braid. Blade. Oh, first try. Hell yeah. Every time you play three attacks in a single turn, gain four block. That's a good one to have. Mm. No, I'm gonna go this way. Even though I have no money for this store. There's another store coming up. Let's upgrade. So you deal 10 damage, deals 2 damage. You deal 12 damage to all. Target intends to attack. Gain eight block instead. Four strength. Gain blo four block three times. So that gives me twelve. What happens when I upgrade you? Retain. Gain four regeneration. And heal two at the end of your turn. Let's let's upgrade scan. Let's deal twelve damage to all enemies. <coughs> As you come to a dead end and begin to turn around, walls slam down from the ceiling, trapping you. Three faces materialize from the walls and speak. Get what you know, and I'll let you go. I require change to see it in space. If you want to pass me, then you must grow. Remove a card, transform a card, upgrade a card. We're gonna upgrade. And then I'm gonna do Brigand's Blade. Uh, do I get the key now? don't really care about... Oof. 
I don't really care about um, getting the additional boss at the end. Normal enemy comp. Yes! Thank you. But I'm loving all of these upgrades. Okay, I want to see what this does. What are bounty rooms? Gain five gold, gain one additional gold for every. It costs zero, you might as well. Okay, we'll hit you. Oh shit, I forgot it. Really? Was that three? That was the last combat. Wow, I didn't realize. Cool. Well, deal six damage if the, if the target is vulnerable, gain a strength, otherwise apply to vulnerable. Gain three dexterity, all enemies gain one strength. Deal seven damage if the enemy has vulnerable, deal seven damage again. We're gonna take the damage cards. I'm gonna transform this card, because I don't necessarily want it anymore. <clears throat> what was that card? Apply four... Apply four frail to all enemies, gain 14 block. That's pretty sick. Damn straight, my guy, I'll take it. <clears throat> and that's where I'm gonna stop. I don't think he actually... Oh shit, I just used that. And he was uh, he was gonna attack me. Gain the regeneration. Gain the block, gain the gold. Damage, damage. I will take nine. Damn, attacking again? You don't have a vulnerable. Honestly, that is a damn good card to have. Oof. Yeah, I was about to say, he's definitely dead. Upon pickup, gain 300 gold. <clears throat> I'm gonna get the split up and farm. That's actually a really decent card. Especially if you upgrade it. I don't really need to heal right now, but I am gonna upgrade Split Up and Farm. It's the slime boss. Let's go ahead and get that regeneration and. I guess in hindsight I could have stopped his. Uh... Okay, these don't gain sh block, do they? I don't think they do. I have to do a lot of damage really fast. I guess I'm doing a lot of damage to me. My only option is to block at that point. Yeah. Okay. So let's do that. 13 damage twice. I'll take it. So that's gonna put them, yep, right below the threshold. And there's the split. Get rid of the slime. Ouch, ouch. Yeah, there we go. And we'll do nine damage. Oh, god, I forgot. I used it on somebody who's attacking, so that doesn't work. Ugh. I could use the block, though. I mean, Damage. 
I gotta find a way to deal more damage or get rid of my debuffs. Save me for one turn. Defend. Defend. I guess I'll just start hitting you. Ouch, 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 ouch. That's gonna hurt. That's gonna hurt. Okay. Let's do Shadow Blade. 13 damage twice. Okay, that'll make two 12s. Not bad, not bad. Oh, that's bad. Holy hell, dude. I'm gonna have one HP. I have one HP. Okay. Let's think about this for a second. So, if I deal 12 damage to all enemies... These two aren't going to split again, so I have to I have to have some defense to block them. So if I do these two, that'll give me just enough. And then I can deal that much damage to that one. I have one HP. This is not good. I'm not in the best situation right now. Uh. That is so bad. So, someone was telling me if I just... Oh yeah, I can restart. Hell yeah. I feel like I can do this a little bit better. I can't keep burning the candle with both ends. I have to make a move at some point. Okay. I know I'm gonna take a lot, <clears throat> but getting that down to five was absolutely crucial to my survival. Alright, so we're gonna deal five damage. Are you kidding me? Seriously? Shit, dude. Alright, 13 damage twice. Let's go. I got this. I got this. Totally have this. As soon as I get another attack. Bada boom, bada bing. There it is. Much better that time around. Ew, gain 10 gold X times. All enemies gain 2 strength X times. Discard your hand, add one ironwood branch into your hand for each card discarded. That's kind of neat. Every time you apply a debuff, you apply one extra stack of that debuff. 
I'm gonna get the Philosopher's Stone. Having that extra energy every turn actually is very important. Oh my god. Let's discard the hand. I want to try this out. Ah, damn it. Oh, those things don't exhaust. That's nice. There we go. Alright, lose 2 HP, apply 6 poison to all enemies. Deal 9 damage 3 times. Deal 9 damage, apply 3 poison, apply 2 additional poison for each power card played this turn. That, I feel like, is going to do a lot more. Okay. something really useless. <sighs> I'm gonna get the Gremlin Horn, because every time an enemy dies, gain an energy and draw a card. <laughs> Super helpful when you're playing against multiple enemies. Ooh, do I have anything that needs removed? I don't have any curses yet. So let's get upgrade all the cards. <sighs> and then I'll take another Manta style. Deal 9 damage 3 times. Another store. Okay. Hey, it's another one of the Brigands cards. That's a good one. Mm -hmm. There's a store up this way. It's only, uh, only going to do 18. Okay, I got Frail on him, so that's good. There we go, there we go. Deal 10 damage, apply 2 poison touch. When the target is attacked, apply poison equal to the amount of poison touched. I heard a very strange noise, and I found out that it's actually one of those big trucks that's had the claw and they pick up garbage and put it in. Yeah, it's one of those. I'm gonna go this way. Ooh, I get to offer a card. Um, that card's not helping me right now. I am going to upgrade. What happens when I upgrade that? Okay, so it just costs zero. I'm going to do that, because when you play that card, you get the ability to draw off of it. So I want to be able to have the... I want to be able to have that handy. Alright, so we're going to do that. 
Hit you with that. Nice, nice. Right, gain the regeneration. Kill you. Deal damage to you, deal damage to you. gonna oh my god look at all this poison is that every time I no it's just the attack Boop. nicely done out of position deal 10 damage if there's only one enemy apply for vulnerable octarine core put two cards from your draw pile into your hand gain two effect is doubled what is up with that? What is that? I I don't know what that means, uh, but I'm just gonna skip it. I need my poison touch to that one. I'll go ahead and gain the block. Hell, dude. Got a freaking little poison touch, man. Uh, actually, don't have any power cards in my hand. That's it. You're dead. Deal 5 HP, deal 5 damage, and 1 vulnerable to all enemies. Deal 16 damage, all enemies take half of the damage dealt. I'm gonna get the healing card, because apparently there's just not very many. Uh, if you do not play any attacks... I have a lot of attacks, though. store. Add one mango, one healing salve, and one bounty rune into your hand. That's cool. Gain two weak, gain eight block. Whenever you are attacked, deal two damage back. That sucks. Absolutely not. A man with an eye patch and a devilish grid strides up to you. Hey there, stranger interested in advancing science? I can make you stronger than any training or blessing. You're going to need it if you want. If you're one of those heroes with a death wish. I can get jacks. I can lose 3 HP, gain 2 strength. Transform 2 cards. Or obtain a special relic where I start each combat with 3 strength. And at the end of my first turn, I lose 3 strength. I'm going to do the special relic. Because that card is super handy. Especially when you're doing your first turn. Harder than that. Okay. Oh, good lord, that did a lot of damage. And haste rune. Take an extra turn after this one. End your turn. Deal 18 damage if the target tends to attack out a wound to your hand. Gain 10 block. Deal 10 HP. You cannot gain HP. I'm gonna deal the 18 damage. Let's upgrade this so it only uses one energy instead of two. And then I'm gonna take another turn after this.
this one. Right? Oh, it still has poison touch. Ooh, boy. You're dead. Okay. No. Let's upgrade while we're here. That heals us a little bit more. That adds it into our hand. That's going to be good because that'll give me 13 times 2 plus the extra 3 strength that we get every turn. Yeah. Yeah, that's going to be sick. So let's do that, and then we're going to... If I restart, will it... I can't believe I just tossed that potion. Please let me have it back. Oh, my God. Okay. All right. So we are going to do that, and we are going to drink instead of discard. Oh, that's not an upgrade card. That's the attack card. The 16 damage applies 6 vulnerable. 24 damage. 11 damage twice. It has vulnerable. Yeah, brother. It's good stuff. Four generation. Okay. We're gonna do this because this gives me some ooh, poison touch. Easy dig. Regeneration. Aw oh, man, Poison Touch didn't do near as much. That's gonna do deal, deal two additional damage for every 10% HP the target is missing. I'm gonna hit him for 27 first and then do that. Poison touch exhaust, it does not. Uh, it'd be really cool if I had that card again. I mean, that's still gonna hit me for a lot, but he's got 30 HP left. And... Let's go. In four metallicize. Anytime you would receive four or less attack damage, this combat reduce it to zero. Deal 25 damage, apply eight vulnerable. Ooh! Choose three cards in your discard pile, return them to your hand, they cost zero. Oh my god. I think I'm gonna do the three cards. Okay, gain one energy at the start of every turn, gain one. Vulnerable, weak, and frail. Have you lost your damn mind? I'd rather not smith at rest sites anymore. <clears throat> God. Although, having two extra energy every turn is going to be super handy. Right. So let's start our poison touch. See, my, my intention when it comes to this particular battle is to try to get them all down around the same HP and then trying to do like a big sweep and kill them all at once. I think it would be a good idea to play this. Let's do that, let's do that, and then hit with that.
Fly 3 angry upon receiving damage gain X strength. Does nothing for X turn. Gain 15 block drops on this card. Gain 6 block, deal 3 damage. Effect is doubled if the floor number is 25 or higher. 35. Okay. I mean, I'll take it. As you head up, uh, as you head upwards, hopping from one floating shape to another, you slip, you begin to fall. What am I going to lose? Dig or Witchblade? Aww. Guess we'll do Witchblade, because that other card is very valuable. It's got extra regeneration. Ooh, Wheel of Misfortune. Let's go. It's going to be, it's going to be, it's going to be full heal. Nice. A highly ornament. Ornamented. Did I say that right? Tomb can be seen on the other side of a floating path upon reaching the tomb. You notice a slot for gold coins with that stretch out, scratched out inscription above it. Start of each combat, apply one week to enemies. I don't want to spend that much gold, especially when I'm about to be at the store and ah, could ah. potentially witness a soul release. Start of each at the start of boss combats deal. Okay, so if I get this. That's going to deal 25 HP to every boss. Am I thinking that correctly? I don't know. We're going to we're going to try it. Let's see what happens. Didn't work. Boss combats. This is an easy. Never mind. I'm dumb. <laughs> oh god, I forgot about the burns. Alright, let's do that. And then use these to find generation. I need to get a card. I need to get the relic that says block is not removed. Okay, do I have three cards in my... I mean, I guess... I mean, I have five that I can do. So I think if I... Hit them like that. Gain some health. Get some more gold. Damage. Okay. Eight damage left. Not bad. Oh, he's got freaking tangible. It's alright, he can't. Two random attacks. Okay. Alright. I wonder if this is... Gain 3 block, 6 damage, that would be 12. 8 vigor next turn. Okay, I like that. Wait, did that say gain 1 vulnerable? That did, didn't it? Yeah. Still not a bad card. Having that vigor is nice. I don't need the rest, so I'm just gonna get the key. Alright, give me a good attack. Harass. Hello, human resources. <laughs> Deal six damage if the target is vulnerable, gain more strength otherwise. Apply two vulnerable. That's gonna be double. That. Oh yeah, I got it in the bag. Easy. Ironwood branches and trees always grant six regeneration. I'm gonna try that. Just because I'm, I'm curious how it's gonna go. Potions always appear. I'll make it. Hey, it's this guy. So, however much damage you do uh, decreases his strength. So, if he is going to attack you, 
then what you want to do is get his HP down as far as it can go. Alright, my next attack damage deals 8 additional damage. Yeah, I was about to say that's going to be a good one. Give me that. Give me that. And give me that. I'll take a vulnerable because I'm not going to get hit. So it's fine. Now my vigor's going to help me out here. Ooh boy. So this is a pretty fun... If you have a lot of defense, this is a fun uh, battle. Because I always like trying to see how much I can do. And if not, I literally just have to... Oh no, I don't want to do that. Cause then that will... Yeah. 71. Good game. Poison. Generation. Great hits. Okay, cool. I think that was his last turn. Yeah, there it was. He only lasts seven turns. Or four or five turns or something like that. Anytime you receive three or less attack damage, this turn reduces to zero. That's gonna be. God, do I fight these guys? Yeah, might as well. Alright. Alright, let's hit him with the initiate. Nine damage. Good luck, brother. What I thought. Three cards. Yeah, I do have some. I have some cards that could benefit. <laughs> Discard our hand to play the branches, which are going to give me more. We're just going to do that. Let's go, dude. I got this in the bag, man. Whenever you lose HP, you lose one less. While this is in your hand, you cannot attack it. This is in your hand at the end of your turn, gain one intangible. I don't like that. I don't like that. I don't like that. All right, I have some money I can spend. Whenever you play a power card, a random card in your hand causes zero this turn. Yeah, we're gonna do that. Duplicate. Did I get that and I don't even have any power cards? Oh. Big yikes. I'm gonna do poison touch again. <clears throat> I'm gonna go through here just to avoid <clears throat> I want to go through there to just to avoid another fight. This is it, guys. The last battle. Gain some more energy. Just keep on dealing some damage. Play the top three cards in the draw pile. And that sucked. It's not good. I'm getting his health down pretty far, though. Mm. Give me that card, give me that card, give me that card. Alright, so the first thing we're gonna do is. 
then we're gonna hit you with that. That's not going to go well. I can tell you right now, that's not going to go well. Let me try taking out the little guys first. Oh, seriously, dude? Shit. touch again, and then we're going to go ham. Good God, look how much poison he has. There we go. Goodbye. Alright, so he's going to regenerate. And now I need some block, like, right now. is going to hit me for a lot more. 33 again, huh? Can you please stop? Nineteen? Please stop. gonna do a lot of damage too. Strike and uh. hey guys, guess what? I win. Yeah. Hell yeah dude, let's go. billion damage. Insanity. Hey, thank you so much for watching. I really enjoyed this one. If you like this mod too, please go download it and show the creator some love. So, thank you, and I will see you on the next one.